Like most cities, the US capital is swamped with phone and computer networks, but much of the information they carry is apparently being intercepted by unknown sources. That's according to security experts who've traced a number of concealed tracking devices across Washington. RT's Guyana Chichikan has more. We are in one of the most spied on cities in the world, Washington, D.C. Here, if you're walking near some powerful building, there's a good chance that your phone is being hacked. A German company came up with a specially outfitted smartphone called CryptoPhone, which can reportedly alert you when there's a surveillance device nearby. The Washington Post took a ride with an executive of the company that promotes the CryptoPhone, and they went to the Russian embassy to test the device. So here we're driving on the behind the Russian embassy. So we got the hit yesterday, uh, earlier today as we went down this little hill. Yeah, and we pulled up. Can we stop here? Oh, wait a second. You just got hit. So this AT&T phone just got full intercepted. They haven't they haven't decided to take over the channel yet, but they have now they've held your NZ long enough to where the baseband here says you need to be careful. But it's not just the Russian embassy that triggers alerts in the crypto phone. The company says in less than two days of driving through the region, they've detected signs of as many as 18 surveillance devices. They put out a map of the locations. It includes the area around the Supreme Court, where we are at the moment, the Capitol, FBI headquarters, different foreign embassies, a cluster of federal contractors around uh, Dulles International Airport. Those devices are called IMSI catchers. They trick mobile phones into thinking that they've logged on to legitimate cell networks when in fact the signals have been hijacked by this fake cell tower. They can be used by pretty much anyone with the right skills. It could be the US government, foreign governments, criminals. Apparently reasonably skilled hobbyists can build such an IMSI interceptor for less than $1,500. Uh, one of the things they can get is actually what you're saying over the phone and uh, can also get your identity, so who you are as you're passing by a range of one of these, uh, one of these surveillance towers. And um, they can probably get full access to your phone to the extent that a legitimate cell phone network tower would be able to do because that's what it's uh, spoofing. It's pretending to be a cell phone company. While the crypto phone's accuracy may not be 100%, Hardly anyone doubts that Washington, D.C. is littered with cell phone data interceptors. And here's, of course, another location that made the crypto phone send alert signals, the White House. And judging by the map of locations where their alert system went off, there's a high probability that it's the U.S. government watching you. But this does not exclude the possibility that private individuals also use the interceptors. In Washington, I'm Ganesh Chekyan, RT. Let's